Okay, boys and girls, yesterday we read a story about seed secrets. We learned about a little bit how they move, how they grow, and all the parts about seeds. Now, before we get started, I have a little rhyme story for us. Are you ready? See if you can read it with me. I might come a little closer so you can see it too. This is called Funny Pup. Pup jumped up on the bed. Pup ducked under the chair. Pup kept us running all day long. Pup was both here and there. Now looking at those words, friends, which one has the short U? Ugly umpire, uh. I see one word. It starts with pa, 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 pa. Let's start it out. Pup, up, pup. Very good. That was just a little warm up to get us started. Now on my board, I said, how do seeds travel? So sometimes when we read books, we might not remember right away. It was yesterday. I don't remember as well. I remember some ideas. So sometimes we have to take our books and we go back and we'll retell. So it starts right here. So how do seeds get from one place to another? Let's review. So some seeds drop down from the plant. Some seeds explode away from the plant. Some seeds travel by air. Okay. Some seeds travel by water. Now notice I'm not having to read all of the words. I'm just looking at the pictures and some of the words. Some sticky seeds travel with animals. Oh. Birds carry the seeds. Oh, squirrels take them, so more animals. And people. Okay, so that gave me enough ideas. So now thinking about this, friends, how can we answer that question? How do seeds travel? I'll give you a minute. We just looked back at our book. Now we need to do some writing. So how do seeds travel? One that I thought was really cool. They make it just a dot. We're going to make our list. Explode. That's pretty cool. They burst and then they get scattered about. How else can they travel? by the air. Very good. They can travel by water. Ooh, what else do they sometimes move around with? They got the bear or the bird or the squirrel. What are those other animals? Very good. Animals can move them about. And last but not least, how else do seeds move around? People, people plant them. So let's take a look back at our list. So we know plants can explode and move from themselves. We know that they can travel by air, that wind picks it up and moves it about and takes it away. Water, they could get into a lake or a river and drift it out. Animals, birds can pick them up. Squirrels can bury. Bears could have it sticky on their backs and rub it on the trees. And then people, we plant them too. So seeds travel lots of different ways. So when I think back to this book, if someone asked and said, what's this book about seed secrets? What would you say? What's the main idea? The main idea was answering that question was how do seeds travel? Now when we think about the main idea, there's different things how we answer or we say the details. These are the details. They explained more about it. They didn't just say explode, air, water, animals, people. They explained with details and pictures and that's what you can do as an author and a writer. You give details for how it looks and why it happens. So that's our main idea, friends, about our book. How do seeds travel? And we answered it. Excellent. All right, we read this in our chime this morning. What was our letter of the week? Uh, uh, ugly umpire, uh. Now remember, 
U is a vowel. That means it's two sounds. This is short U. Long U just says U. It says its name. So we have U. Now let's see. Do you remember our new sight words for the week? Let me get our chart up. Are you ready? Was. And here. Make sure you're using those in our new journal and when you start writing. Those are words that I hope that you are learning and you remember because when we see them in our guided reading books, we'll know what they are. All right, friends. Thank you so much. Miss Hayden will make another video to practice making uppercase U. And remember, main idea and details. When you read a book, it can be any book. It doesn't have to be your Seed Secrets book. Always think, what's the main idea? What is this book about? Thanks so much, friends. We'll see each other soon.